Liz. Liz. All right, Liz. So today we have a couple of questions for you. So what is your dog's name and how did you come up with his or her name? Oh, so this is Riley. So her name came Be from calm, a, ch you know. um, a kid's magazine that my son happened to be reading for school. And I said, we need a name for the dog. And the kids looked at the magazine and there was a character named Riley in the magazine. So we named her Riley. All right. So what do you think is a benefit of o owning a dog or several dogs? Oh, like a personal okay. benefit? Because there's a huge benefit. Because no matter what, they always love you. They think you're great that you're always their hero. They are always happy to see you. They are never in a bad mood. They love you unconditionally and never complain. So final question. What are the responsibilities one has to face if thinking about becoming a dog owner? You have to you know, walk the dog three times a day. That's the biggest thing. Um, but it's so worth it. The benefits far outweigh the annoyances of the midnight run. Oh, well, thank you for being with us. Do you want to say something? <laughs> <laughs> Hello, we're here with John. So, John, what are the responsibilities one has to face if thinking about becoming a dog owner? Picking up poop. Every dog owner has a responsibility to pick up his or her dog's poop. Uh, and But it's a tremendous amount of responsibility. You don't, you don't really realize it. Can your dog do any special tricks that you want to like show the people? Um, she'll jump. She knows how to jump over stuff. All right, let's see. Hold up, hold up. Yeah. Oh, look at that stance. Hey, <laughs> that was so. Oh my God, so she's awesome. What is your dog's name and how did you come up with his or her name? Her name is Sienna and we came up with her name because she's an Italian dog. She's from a part of Italy called Emilia Romagna and in Italy uh, her breed hunts for truffles which are kind of mushrooms that are under the ground um, and the reason we chose the name Sienna is that one of our daughters spent uh, six months studying in Siena which is a town in Italy. So that's a long answer to your question. <laughs> Next question. <laughs> How special is your dog to you and what roles do they play in your life? That's a good question. Uh, Sienna's very special. She's our first dog and we got her um, because our youngest daughter had always wanted a dog. And since she was going to be going away to college, we figured we didn't want to have an empty nest all of a sudden. So we got Sienna. So Sienna is our, kind of our, sounds a little strange, but our youngest child now. So we're here with... Layla. What's up, Layla? So we got a couple questions about your dog. So what's your dog's name, and how did you come up with his or her name? Um, my dog's name is Mona, and you know, I have a dog in another country. His name is Moni, so we just called her Mona. Yeah, nothing interesting. So we're here with... Kristen Roby. All right, so Christine, what is your dog's name and how did you come up with his or her name? His name is Magic. He's from uh, Florida, where they have Disney World. The magic of Disney was everywhere you turned to see. So it seemed that a oh. fitting name, plus he's magical. So. I can see, look at him. And he does magic tricks. What do you think are the benefits of owning a dog or several dogs? Because, you know, we got the cat people, the dog people. Um, well, you know, sometimes she eats your homework. She did that to me once. It was great. <laughs> it was great. It was great. Um, what else? You know, when you're feeling down, she just, like, comes up and she, like, hugs you and loves you and stuff. So it's great, you know. She, yeah, she just knows when you're feeling down. So how special is your dog to you and what roles do they play in your life? Well, dog is God spelled backwards. So he's like the little God fairy in my life. <laughs> And he makes me very happy. He's eight and a half. And since I retired, I, my daughter lives in Tokyo. So he's like my buddy. What's the benefit of owning a dog or several dogs and what responsibilities do they come with? Oh, it's a big responsibility because it's almost like a child. You know, you bathe them, you feed them, you train them, you have to look after them. They can't be ignored. <laughs> At least this one won't let you ignore him. So, but it, it's a very dynamic relationship that you can have. And as we know, especially these days, people are not 
let's say, the most uh, appealing people. Yeah, everybody Pe just, I call them gray face. Is that gray it? Face, yeah. Like, yeah. People are very stressed and very, <laughs> uh, you know, have uh, very a lot of issues. So you come to a dog and then every night when you come home, it's just pure love. <laughs> so it's worth all the money and the time you put into it.